Hi everyone, Wally Nichols here. I thought I'd do something a little bit different for the Asset Guidance Group weekly update because I got my COVID vaccine uh, shot this week. I thought I would share some raw footage of my experience and hopefully you'll enjoy it. I'll see you on the other side. So the first thing that you do after you get into the following the signs off the 85 is go down to the Delta Flight Museum. They wind you through the parking lot. My line wasn't very long, it was about 15 minutes. And then you get queued up for the refrigeration tents, which is the first time they're identifying you. Of course, they start the identification through either your, uh, your, your phone and they get a QR code, so they just verify your identity and all your information is still accurate. You're not sick and everything. And then boom, you're in the tent. So this is... Uh Tent one as you go in. I guess this is the fridge and they're storing the vaccines in. I don't know. We'll find out as we get up there, but it's a thing. It's a thing down here. Alright. Well, I'm waiting. It was no big deal. <clears throat> they you go through, you get your shot, it happens so fast, you don't even know it. Didn't have time to put the thing on. But anyway, now they've got everybody waiting in a staging area after getting the shot. I think we have to sit here for 15 minutes to make sure that we're all good to go. So you never left the vehicle, never left the car, just pull through, bam, 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 everything's automated except for the shot. And uh, they administer the shot and then you come back out and you sit here and you wait for 15 minutes to make sure that there's no adverse reactions. And I suppose they'll let us go here momentarily. <clears throat> so that was that. This is about, it's about like, it was faster than voting, that's about it. And already, the reason I didn't get the video going when I got it was because they give you this thing and they're just wanting to uh, sign up for the, um, for the second dose, you know, already. So we got that in, so that's all good. And it's been, I don't know, five, six minutes since I was administered. So I'm feeling fine, I'm feeling good, it was no big deal. It didn't even uh, didn't even feel the needle go in my arm. It was just bam, bam. It was over, and so that's it. And nothing to it. Everybody should do it. It's it's marvelous technology, and it allows us to go back to normal and get and get things running again. The economy, everything. So, I'm psyched. I'm happy. I'm ready to be done with this. I got my second dose already confirmed. April the twelfth one something in the afternoon bada bing bada bing it was easy it was everything's marked they're very efficient this is a national guard or the army i don't know but it's like one of the two anyway they're doing the lord's work down here and uh and it's all good so go on the website get signed up do it man let's get things going back the way they used to be all right, well, I hope that you enjoyed that, and I've laid any concerns for those of you who haven't got it yet that you might have, and uh, I, I was proud to be an American. I know that there are millions of people around the world, especially in places like China, where the population is so large. They'd love to get the vaccine, but they don't have the opportunity to get it. We do in America. We do a miracle of science and technology within a year. And it's just a wonderful feeling to know that uh, just a couple of more weeks and this is all behind me. I hope it is for you guys too because we've got to stop the spread. When it spreads, uh, that's it, how the variants come and this thing just drags out forever. And there's a lot of evidence that the vaccines are making the symptoms that the long haulers have had. People that have recovered from COVID-19 months ago but still have lingering side effects. The vaccines make it go away. So. Uh, I'll look forward to seeing you again next week. This is Wally saying hang in there, stay happy, and we're going back to normal real soon.